Today we're going to talk about how we break down for that ground ball as that ball approaches to us. When that ball is getting to us, I want to go right, left, down. By down, I really want to sink into my hips. When I sink into my hips, this allows me to read that ground ball. We're able to read that hop. You're able to stay in an athletic position. Coaching little kids, the biggest thing I see is they just want to bend over at their back. When you bend over at your back, you can't read those hops. Sinking into our hips will really allow us to stay in that athletic position. It'll keep us on our toes and we won't fall back on our heels. We are here with Drew who's going to show us how to properly break down for that ground ball to make that play. So as this ball is approaching to us, we want to go right, left, down. As you see, he's feeling this ball on the left side of his body. This allows us to be ready to make that throw to first base. He is feeling the ball out in front of him. He has a flat back and he's sunk into his hips. He's not bending over at the, our back. When we're sunk into our hips, we're able to read that ground ball. This also then allows us to stay on our toes. When we fall back on our heels, we're not able to make this play. Staying on our toes will allow us to make this play, get ready to make our throw. These are some of the things that we don't want to see. When we approach the ball, as you see, he comes up to the ball and he bends straight over at his back. We will not be able to read a ground ball bending over this way. He will start to fall back onto his heels. We will automatically not be in position to make that good play. To sum up what we talked about today, is how to break down for that ground ball as it, as it approaches to us. Some of the things we really want to remember, right, left, down, we want to be sunk into our hips, we don't want to bend over at our back. We really want to make sure we feel it on the left side of our body so we're in position to make a good throw. We don't want to fall back onto our heels. We stay on our toes. That will allow us to complete this play.